Hi everyone, today I'm going to show you how to do a Google reverse image search. So you can see I'm on a new Google search and if you go up to the top right hand corner you can click images and see it takes us to a specific place to search images. Now you can just start googling something so say I want um, Martin Luther King Jr. Okay, and you can see many pictures come up and you can see where they live on the internet. Okay, you want to make sure that your picture lives on a reputable site. But I really want this picture and this NIOT.org, I have no idea what it is, so I'm going to click on the picture. I'm going to right click and it gives you the choice to search Google for image. Brings us to a new page. And if you look through the results, you can see where the picture lives on the internet. Wikipedia, not a reputable source, so we're not going to go there. Nobelprize.org, sure. And sometimes you have to go past the first page of results to find something that really jumps out. NewYorkTimes.com, perfect. New York Times, we know, is a reputable news source. So if we open that up, and if we scroll down into this, into this article, there's the picture. So then you would cite this article because the art, the picture lives in this reputable place of the New York Times. Okay, let's go back to our image search. We'll go back again. Okay, if you had a picture, let's say, let's say you were on Instagram and you weren't sure if this picture was actually real. You could click search by image and you can either paste the URL or you can upload an image. So if you're on Instagram, you could take a screenshot of the image and then you can upload it. So I'm going to go ahead and choose a file that I've already taken a screenshot of. And I don't know if you're familiar with this picture, but it is a very famously doctored photo. Okay. So you can go and see, again, Wikipedia is always, is usually the first result. Okay. So you can look and see where this image lives and you can actually see if it's legit. Okay. So look, it's on hoaxes.org. Okay. And if you click on any of these, you'll find out that um, this is actually a huge hoax. Um, here we go. 10 of the worst Photoshop disasters and pictures. So again, you can tell that this picture is a huge hoax. Um, and you wouldn't want to use it as something in one of your research articles and let our research projects unless of course you were doing a research on hoaxes. So that is Google reverse image search in a nutshell.